Ever since he was named as one of the Ocampo Six, the man who is now Kenya's Deputy President, William Ruto, has had a dark cloud, so to speak, hanging over his head. That cloud has lifted at least for now, and pundits say this has opened a whole new spectrum of possibilities for both him and the Jubilee Alliance. KTN's Duncan Haimba now reports. Sights and sounds that engulfed his current residence immediately the International Criminal Court terminated his case. Deputy President William Ruto can rest easy at least for now since the declaration of a mistrial doesn't mean acquittal. Yes, it is good for the accused that uh, they are off the hook at least for the time being but this would normally call for being a little more cautious, a little more reflective rather than going out to do chest thumping and celebrating yeah, because uh, the matters remain unresolved. The ICC cloud hanging over Ruto has been fodder for much grumbling and threats from the URP side of the Jubilee Coalition with URP membership pushing the TNA counterparts to ensure they show as much zeal in defending Ruto as was shown in Uhuru Kenyatta's defense. When uh, he also sits down to talk uh, with the President Kenyatta about uh, their unity within uh, the Jubilee Alliance, that uh, he does so now as a, a free man and therefore a man with very many options, including the option, if he wants, of uh, throwing his heart into the ring. If the stakes will be so high, especially on the side of William Ruto, he'll want to go into the 2017 elections with his side trained on the 2022 election. However, there have been speculations that political undercurrents within Jubilee that have made it difficult for affiliate parties to merge could split the coalition now that their common denominator ICC is behind them. It is within President uh, Uhuru Kenyatta's uh, greatest uh, interest and of those around him to ensure that uh, they continue to treat uh, the deputy president well and that uh, they can assure him at the very, very minimum that uh, they respect uh, him, they respect his portfolio. Tuesday's decision by ICC might embolden Ruto's political career. He's uh, an ambitious politician like everybody else, but he's not just ambitious, he's also wise. And wisdom would advise him that uh, there is uh, also the element of timing, whether this would be the perfect uh, time for him to throw his heart uh, into the ring. Wisdom would advise her against that. On 16th this month, President Uhuru Kenyatta and his deputy William Ruto will troop to Nakuru's Afraha Stadium for a Thanksgiving service following the termination of their cases. The ICC storm that has surrounded Deputy President William Ruto for close to seven years is now over. Will he be a kingmaker in 2017 or will he go for the crown? Duncan Hemba, KTN News. Nairobi.